Joined by defenseman Matt Clark. And uh, Matt, you guys ended the season last year 15-5. and five. How much does that help your confidence coming into this season? Yeah, I mean, you know, we had a pretty big learning curve last year. We had a lot of young guys. So near the end, we started to find our groove and started to come together as a unit. So definitely, you know, the, for the returning guys, it's, uh, you know, that much more confidence in your own game and the game of your teammates. So, you know. Um, it definitely helps us going in this season, and uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. And you had so many rookies last year, including yourself, more than a dozen throughout the course of the season. How much is it going to help that you guys now have a full year under your belt? Yeah, I mean, it makes a huge difference. You don't realize the, the jump um, from junior or college to pro. Um, so, you know, having that, that first season under the belt is, is huge. So, I mean, hopefully, you know, our second and everyone, everyone can chip in. Uh, as much as we can this year. And you had a long off season. Uh, any highlights over the summer? Uh, what do you do to uh, you know use up your time? Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, for a while you just kind of take it easy. Get you know, get away from the ranks. Get it, you know, get to spend time with whether it's your family, you know, girlfriend, friends, and uh, just kind of hang out for a bit. And then you know, you get right back at it. You know, because summer is the time when you can really improve your game and. If you work hard enough, you can really take it to a whole new level the next year. So, I mean, as much as you take time off, you know, you're you're back at at it pretty pretty quick. And uh, how do things change uh, as you've now been to multiple training camps? Uh, are there adjustments you make from year to year at training camp? Absolutely. I mean, each year, you know, you bring that much more confidence, and uh, so it definitely felt a lot different this year, and it's uh, it's fun. Now, you had a chance to come back during the summer to Syracuse to take part in the Crunch Classic Golf Tournament. Uh, how did you fare? How did your team fare? And how nice was it to come back to Syracuse uh, during the summer and see some trees and not snow? Yeah, yeah, no, it was pretty cool. I saw a side of Syracuse I've never seen before. But, uh, yeah, no, that was, that was a fun time. Uh, you know, Kyle came down, too, and played. So uh, we, uh, we had some fun. You know, golf isn't my, my specialty, but I uh, helped my team out when I could, and, and we did, ended up doing all right. So uh, that was nice. All right, Matt, good luck the rest of the way at training camp. Yeah, thank you very much. It's Matt Clark joining us on your Crunch Broadcast Network. I'm joined by center Peter Holland. And, Peter, you got a taste of professional hockey last year. You performed magnificently with six points in three games. How nice was it to get uh, at least a taste of pro hockey right at the end of your uh, junior career. Well, I think it was definitely uh, important for myself to come in, and uh, you know, obviously doing well was a bit of a confidence boost for myself. And uh, you know, it was it was definitely nice to do well here, and uh, the guys welcomed me with open arms, and uh, just try to carry that through the summer and uh, and come back confident this year again. Everybody talks about how tough it is going from juniors or college ranks up to the pros. Seems like you did it seamlessly. Was it really that easy? You know, I know the guys up here, they're a lot bigger and faster and uh, just a lot more positionally sound. Uh, you know, they take away a lot of your time and space out there. But uh, like I said, I was playing with some great line mates when I came up and, uh, you know, a couple bounces went my way and uh, ended up on the score sheet. So. And during the summer, what are some of the big things you wanted to work on for this season? Just continue developing uh, physically and uh, just maturing my game pretty much. Uh, you know, not putting too much pressure on myself and uh, just trying to come out here and have some fun. And a chance to take part in uh, Ducks training camp this year again. What's it like playing out there with guys like Timu Solani, Ryan Getzlaff, Corey Perry? You know, I just tried to be as big of a sponge as I could and just kind of take it all in again. Uh, it was my third camp with those guys, and, uh, you know, it seems like I learned something every time I'm out on the ice with those guys. So uh, it was a lot of fun, but uh, I'm excited to get it started here. And what's it like coming here? You now know some faces. You know, it's not a completely new team for you. How much does it help that you know some of the guys in the locker room? Yeah, it's definitely easier. You know, you can uh, be yourself a little bit more. Uh, you know, the guys you know the guys from previous camps and summers and stuff and skating with them. So, uh, yeah, it's definitely nice and, uh, you know, how helps you be yourself here. Peter, good luck the rest of the way. Thank you. Peter Holland joining us on your Crunch Broadcast Network.